Hello, Internet. We're here again. Box office predictions, the not blockbuster category. We're here uh, talking about Book Smart. Let's go. Let's quickly go over its pros and cons because honestly, this is not going to be a long video. Because <laughs> I know nothing about this. This looks like one of those comedies, like a hard R comedy. And it's. Is it high school? Is it a high school comedy? It's either high school or college. I don't know. But it's one of those school-themed comedies. And school-themed comedies, if they're done well, they can do well, you know. But a lot of them involve sex, you know, like American Pie, for instance. But let's just go over some its pros and cons. Pros? Um, not sure that there's any, like, super pros. Maybe it can do well. Maybe it could be decent counter programming towards um, Aladdin and Brightburn. <laughs> uh, maybe, maybe it could be a sleeper hit, but I don't know. I don't know about that because there has been been like real reviews out there, and I haven't seen one single trailer, <laughs> so I can't really judge a film like that. But let's go over its potential cons. There are too many movies in the market. <laughs> it's ridiculous. Particularly female, you know, centric films. I mean, you, let's look at let's look at things. In May alone, we have let's get this. We have Long Shot, we have Palms, we have The Hustle, we have The Sun is also a star. And then there's this. That's too much. That's way too much. You're just going to oversaturate the market these movies are probably going to cannibalize each other there <laughs> because of that so this movie may not stand much of a chance in the grand scheme of things because of all that competition you know before it comes out and after it comes out because may is such a a loaded month when it comes to releases it's by far and away the busiest month of the summer because july is very quiet and the only month that's even close to this competitive is August. But we'll get to that in a long time from now. But overall, Booksmart, I think it's just going to underperform. I don't think it's going to do what particularly well. Predictions, uh, three-day will probably be between five and ten. Uh, four-day will be like in the low teens potentially or the high single digits who knows and it's overall total will be between 30 and 40 i might be not yeah no 20 and 30 it's more realistic i might be wrong but there's just so much competition there's just so much out there that this movie will likely get lost in the shuffle because that's how it works sometimes it's sad but it's true so yeah, that's book smart for you. Uh, next up, we have probably be the biggest of the bunch when it comes to the not blockbuster category, and that's Rocket Man. So we're gonna talk about you know, that movie's potential. So make sure to subscribe, like this video, leave a comment. I've made two playlists: the blockbusters and the not blockbusters of t summer 2019. If you wanna go check those out, go right ahead. Other than that, that is all, and I am out.